Well, if you too, it's your boy Darius. I want to thank you guys for watching. You guys could be anywhere else in the world. But you hear me, I really appreciate that. Make sure you subscribe to your boy, leave a like, give you guys any recommendations, leave a comment section, get to as soon as possible. Where about I do right now, about react to Five Gay Men versus One Secret Straight Man by Jubilee. Um, a uh, disclaimer, I am not gay. You know what I'm saying? Not, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with being gay or anything like that. I feel like being gay is pretty cool and everything. It just, I'm not gay. You know what I'm saying? It, it, you know, it's just not for me. With that being said, we're about to check this out. You know, the odd one now. Uh, we're about to figure out who is the, who the secret straight man, uh, who the gay man. Uh, so, enough of the blah, blah, blah. Let get straight to the video. I'm gay. 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 See that? Like, see that? Uh, uh, I kind of have a feeling who is. Everyone I kind of feel like I have a feeling uh, who is who, but let's like, check it out. You know, you don't, you really don't know. So they were gay. Um, probably like end of high. school. One, one is obvious. The great, the guy with the green chair, he definitely gay. Look at that Ooh, Queen, New York. Ha ha ha! That was LL from. And it was just. Wait, that. End of high school, after my first relationship, uh, it was a girl, and mm. it was just not for me. Um, I think for me, it was in middle school. It was, like, before puberty, so... What the hell? Why are you wearing a belly shirt, man? Get a bigger shirt! I'm figuring things out for myself, and also other kids were understanding, too, so mm. that really helped me to find myself when I would talk about it. Honestly, you know, I think the newer generation, they have, they have more understanding of what the LGBT community is, what, uh, what being gay is, and everything. I think, I feel like... The newer generations, you know what I'm saying, uh, are more accepting now than um than ever, ever before. And I, and I, I think that's a great thing, in my opinion. Right. 15. Why the fuck your name is Lucifer? You know what I'm saying? You know, what, like, what, you heavy metal? Break it law, break it law, break it law. What the, why, why your name is Lucifer, man? That's Sunday. So, I know exactly when it was. <laughs> I grew up in... Wait, what do you say? 15. Mm. So, I know exactly when it was. <laughs> I grew up in a very religious home, mm. and I, too, was in relationships with, with girls. So um, what I did was I, I, hid, I hid myself for a long time. So it's, he definitely I'm trying did, not though. to tear up. Um, <clears throat> it wasn't until the pandemic. Oh, he's not fake. <laughs> when he ain't I fake. came out to my little brother, I actually knew when I was eight. Um, my grandma took me to see Mamma Mia, and if you've seen the movie, you know <laughs> the beach scene. Yeah. You know exactly what I'm... That, that, I... I actually watched that movie, you know what I'm saying? I, um, I, like, I didn't think any gay or love it, so. Talking about, and I knew something was just a little bit off about me when I realized that I was more attracted to Sky than I was Sophie. I'm like, mm. something about him. You know, mine honestly is right. But, and, and I've heard that too. I've heard that, you know, like kids, you know, like they, like they normally know when they, when they, were, when they were young, if, if they're more attracted to girls or attracted to guys. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, kids. Kids are not stupid, you know what I'm saying? Kids are more, um, kid, kids are more, uh, are smarter than you think. You know what I'm saying? They're more, they're more aware of themselves than you think. You, you, you get what I'm saying? Twilight came out. Oh, oh I hate that movie. First of all, Twilight, that's a horrible, that, that dude was not even a, a, a vampire. It was, you don't glow. Blade is more a vampire than he is. So good. Of course, of course, um, Pattinson for sure, um. Edward. I knew in middle school, like, there was something up with me. I was like, I like men. That's 100%. But I called myself bisexual, and then freshman year in high school, I was just like, I'm gay. Like, the way I feel about women is like, there was something up with me. I was like, I like men. That's 100%. But I called myself bisexual, and then freshman year in high school, I was just like, I'm gay. Like, the way I feel about women is not nothing like the way I feel about men. Okay. I already revealed mine, but what is everyone's favorite celebrity crush? Mine is also a vampire. It's Paul Wesley from okay. Vampire Diaries. He was okay. like my I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Really? I'm never yeah. into the yeah. vampire yeah. stuff. Yeah, we got Ross Lynch. Something about that man is just, ooh, uh, just, ah, uh, I just love Ross Lynch. Yeah. Uh -oh. Prince and Idris Elba. Mine mm. was mine right now. I think is is Pedro Pascal. You on the Pedro mm. Pascal? So yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I am. I'm your daddy. Matt Bomber. What? Uh, from my collar. Look, like the yeah. snake eyes are so sexy. <laughs> like that's it. What do you guys hate about straight? Oh, uh, like, um, if I had to guess who the mo is, you know, it probably, probably one of those two, Matt and the dude with the, uh, with the tie and everything. 
their inability to like take criticism oh or take God, no as yes. an answer. Yeah. Like, what is up with that? Yeah. Like, I understand Take-do, patriarch Disney and all that, that, but still, I know, like consent, literally. Um, yeah, their inability to have any sort of fashion. It's just <laughs> t-shirts. <laughs> now, there's some straight guys who do have some uh, sense of fashion, but but yeah, a lot of straight guys though. In jeans, this. t-shirts, jeans, or like just basketball shorts. You know, you, know, you see those men. I mean, I mean, you know, I mean, you know like uh, we're not like. I, I, no, most most guys, you know, they're not like they're not dressed to a prayer. They just um, they just do what they what they have to do. You get what I'm saying? Who clearly use like the three in one shampoos, and I'm just like, I do oh, do that. Like, I use that. They brush their teeth with it. Yeah, like, I don't do that. Oh my god, this one guy had a ten in one. I did not even no want to way. ask what he meant. Lucifer, I just wanted to ask you. Um, so you said at fifteen is when you knew, right? That that you were gay. Yes, that's when I came to terms with it for myself. And then you said at co- like during COVID was when you told your brother. Yes. So that whole time he didn't know? No. Really? How, how did that feel for you? I didn't go quite yet. Because were you guys close? Or? We were, but I moved from Memphis when I was 18. Okay. Mm. We've been long distance for... Oh, a- I thought Memphis had, had, had like a good LGBT uh, community uh, um, that, out there. No, no, no. Atlanta, Atlanta does. Atlanta does. Time. Yes. He really didn't make a big deal out of it. Just told me that he loved me no matter what. That's just, cool. Can, can I ask why did you not come on to him earlier if you guys felt so comfortable together with that? Yes. That's it. I mean, yeah. I mean, you know, at the end of the day, it's it's a person's decision. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like, you know, it means, uh, you know, that, there's all sorts of reasons why he probably didn't come out. You know, probably didn't feel comfortable with himself or anything like that. But like, but there's all sorts of reasons. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't feel like he owed anyone a, an explanation. But I guess. So for me, when I was growing up, the thing that mattered. But he's competitive. Was I can see that. I had to keep that facade. When I was growing up. The thing that mattered most was getting married and having a family. I had yep. to keep that facade a long time. I was actually practicing to be a minister in 2012. Oh, wow. Right. When- and and that's and that's the day with the black community. You know, I say black like, like you know like saying uh, and of, of course not everyone obviously, but uh like but uh, but the, but the thing within our community is that you know many many of us tend to be homophobic. You know, what I'm saying we tend to be homophobic, and I, I think I, I think that's just BS. I don't know if it's just religion or if because of our machismo or whatever. I think that's just bullshit. But whatever. Uh, President Obama uh, declared gay marriage uh, legalized nationwide, and when I was in hi, it's over. Hey, have you spotted the mole yet? Well, hang tight because we're gonna get there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who that be? Nah, he gay. No, no. That, that tank top that he's wearing is is really tacky. It is. I agree. No, just gay. Like just the jeans and the shirt. No, just no. Just is hella gay, man. He's gay, man. I know that. It's it's either Matt or the what the dude name with the tie. Good luck, guys. It could be Cole. It could be that dude with the red shirt. A little bit. Kind of hurted. Why do you think they were suspicious of you? Um, mainly because I'm wearing just jeans and a t-shirt, but I look stylish and I look amazing. So. But uh, but one thing I do know about being gay, though, I'm sorry for pausing a lot, y'all. But uh, one thing I do know about um being gay, and, and I'm not gay, but one thing I, one thing I do know is that being gay is not monolithic. You know, you know what I'm saying? Um, you know, it, that that no like criteria of being gay, like like not every fucking gay person listens to Barbara Streisand or Lady Gaga. You know what I'm saying? Something like, something like, you know, like there are gay men out there who dress, who dress like regular men. You know what I'm saying? They dress dress, dress up like you no know, casual, you no know, tr- uh, uh, t-shirt, um, jeans, and everything. You know what I'm saying? They they just as machimo as a as a next person. They, they they may not be all feminine and everything. You know what I'm saying? They they're no monolithic of being gay. You get what I'm saying? But I digress. Um, Lucifer, I remember you were mentioning that like gay marriage was being legalized in 2012, but it was 2015, right? 2013. Yeah, that's 2013. Yeah. Oh, okay. that, that's, yeah. So like, why well, legalized yeah, though? It was. I, I remember it precisely. I was, I was on the phone with my pastor actually when that mm. announcement was made. He was running in 2012, so yeah, he right. would have. Right. So 15, 16. I'm bad at math. I'm terrible. Well, it, it, it took it took a while for it to actually go into legislation. Gotcha. So you can say 2012, but if you're technically, yes, it, it did take a, okay, okay. a few years into that second term before it was actually registered. Okay, so, the 15, so, he, so this dude was right. Oh, creativity, um, mm. style, and confidence. Number one would be hygiene. 
Yeah. Mm. I bathe at least twice a day, if you know, not more. In a drought. So, yeah, we are. <laughs> well, well, not anymore. Not anymore. It's been raining as hell for the past three months. So not anymore. We're not in the drought anymore. <laughs> Look, you know, I gotta freshen up. So I expect yeah, yeah, yeah. that from someone else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I get that. I get that. Yeah. Yeah, my boyfriend, every time I, or my ex-boyfriend, oh, no. yeah, every time I'd come in, like, the room was just super messy, and, like, I'm really big on bathroom cleanliness. Mm. Yes, mm. it's the last place you are at night and the first place you are in exactly. the morning, and most traditional men are just, um, dirty in the bathrooms. Right. Um, for me, definitely funny, and, I mean, obviously, I feel good. That's, that's... <laughs> Yeah, he hasn't spoken uh, much. <laughs> it's all, it's always the ones who don't speak much, you know, like that end up being the mold. You know what I'm saying? Just hanging by with me. I'm a very active person, whether that be like I'm going out hiking. So he might be the mold. No, height doesn't really matter. I mean, haven't found anybody as tall as me <laughs> yeah. yet. Um, how are you? Six, six. Okay. How about you? Huh? Like, huh? Like he's six foot six? Huh? Like, you know, need like you need to play for the fucking uh, what like what the team that needs him? Um, you know, he need you need to play you need to play for the Grizzlies. You know, John John Mar- John Moran needs you. You know what I'm saying? Dylan Brooks is out the door, so John Moran needs you on the Grizzlies. <laughs> uh, six two, but I have these on me now, so a little bit taller. I love those, by the way. Oh, thanks. Yeah, they're they're brand cool. new. They're Doc Me too. Me too. <laughs> Look at. I love ducks. These are the brand new model. They have the. Yeah, okay. I know. I saw those. Oh, I saw so those. Cool. Did it's you miss cool. the memo that we were supposed to wear boots there? <laughs> yes. Yeah, I did. You know, I do prefer men that are shorter than me. Um, a little more on the submissive side. Wow. Um, I- Let me get your... You don't even look like you're a top! You don't look like you're a dominant! What? Eat the bottom. Oh. Um, I'm... Dude, dude, wait, wait. Let me go back to him. Don't look like the... Mo- the other than Ricky, you look like the most bottomless of all, of all... Everyone in there, other than Ricky. Come on, man. You don't look like a freaking... You look like you're the most bottom... I don't know, man. Why, why are people hating the bottom, man? I guess because I was in such a controlled environment for so mm. many years, I just have a way of controlling that space. Okay. Can we run down and say what we are? Like, you already answered. Yes. We'll say bottom. Top. Or verse. Top first. I, I say I'm a, I'm a first top. Yeah. First that dude don't look like a freaking top. That dude don't look like a top. No, 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 I'm not buying it. I am not buying it. No, no. He's definitely a bottom. Really yeah, a bottom that's what I said. Sure. Did you see what this man is wearing? Had the mid drift and all. Yeah, just takes the Yeah, right you're a bottom. Yeah, I agree. I think it's very dependent. But honestly, so, like, so Ricky could be the mole. Or so when it's with like hookups and stuff like that. Well, baby, I'm a Scorpio, so like. <laughs> Me too. Oh, oh nice. <laughs> so nice. <laughs> But you know, but you know what? You know, I, I know a lot of people are more. You know, like it doesn't matter what role people is. When Matt got up, Lucifer, that that was. I was like, okay, that was a little. That was a little straight. That felt very hetero to me. Ew. Oh, and ew. That felt hell. Prince get a depth. A gay Prince can get depths? Really? And this man had a nerve to say he's the top. Good thing. If they're open to threesomes, because I mm. I want to do that. Hey, say it to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why you guys are playing Marvin Gaye, man? Lucifer is a baby here. <laughs> Marvin Gaye with the straight I mean, men. On paper, I'm not gonna. I just want to break the truth to you. Uh, really? Because it's just like it's just another person. It it just gets a lot. I don't it know. Is. I just feel like I, I right? completely agree. It's more of a novelty for sure. It's yes, like a lot yes, of just sitting yes, around yes. or <laughs> <laughs> sitting around. Yeah, just one waiting. Person's waiting. When's the mic yeah. going? Oh, no, it's, like, it's like two at a time. I mean, it's like great. Let's do a round of smash or pass. Dominic Fike. Smash. 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 Michael B. Jordan. Smash. 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 Creep. I'm not a gay man, and even now we'll be with Michael. No, 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 no. Creed. Oh Creed. Creed is a great movie. What? Passing on The Rock? The Rock? You guys have never... See that, see that man? These damn younger generations, man. Sorry, yeah. I'm so sorry. Oh, my God. Wait, sorry. That's, that's so surprising to me, because you said that you were a top, like you like being in control. Dude, The Rock? Yeah. Okay. I can tell you. I'm shorter than you. Wait. Yeah, I am. But the I Rock mean, is huge. Yeah, I'm Rock like, is huge. Six foot five. No, six foot four. No, no, tri- no, no, no. Triple H is six foot four, and The Rock is uh, six foot five because, uh, let me see. Ain't nobody talking. Talk.
soft in the rock. Come on. That's sus. Rock's ugly. The rock get in. I'm not gonna comment on that. Lucifer is gay as hell. Thank you. He's gay as hell. Yeah, everyone. Oh, they bitches. They jealous. <laughs> they see. They see. They see. I'm totally star power. They just didn't want to share the money with me. I'm not someone that gets offended easily, but bitch, that offended me. I am offended. This I'm offended for you, bro. This is personal. It's like you know. That's like Michael Jordan. This is personal. <laughs> This is the shit I'm talking about. This makes no damn sense. Yeah, you're gay, look man. Look at me. What? Do I look straight to you? Fuck no, you don't look straight. Hell no. No, 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 no. Come on. You want to continue playing because you think that there's potentially still a liar among the four of you in the box? Raise your hand on three, all right? One, two, three. Wait, raise your hand just continue playing? Yes. I'm, I'm not sure. I am not buying Before Ricky being top. Is, out. is that correct? I think so. I can unconfidently say. Yeah. It's like my besties right here. Oh. <laughs> so that means the game has ended. Okay. If the box turns green. Why is that going to turn red? I hope it turns red. I hope it turns red. If the box turns red. That means the mole is still among you four, and they win the cash prize themselves. Are you guys ready? It's red. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I knew it. Like, the mole was still there. You knew? I was unconfident. Don't I was surprised. unconfident. I said, what? I said. Why <laughs> oh, would I act surprised? This is. I, I think it's Matt, too. Or, or that other dude with the tie. All right. But damn sure it wasn't Justin, and Lucifer is gay as hell. So the mole has won. And on the count of three, I'm going to have the mole step forward. Woo, I'm nervous. One. Two. Three. <laughs> it's cold. Oh, yeah. What? We're all the most. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, I know it. Oh, I think there was a mix up, you guys. Look at us. We are besties bro, after all. I was very all confused. Bro, I was yeah. like, you had me. Hey, we got wait. Everyone's a mo. Wait, wait. Everyone's a mo. What? For real? Dude, yeah. Dude, they, dude, this is my girlfriend C. Ooh, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I'm confused. I was very We're confused. Oh, I was yeah. like. You wait, 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 what? We're all the most. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I think there was a mix up, you guys. Look at us. We are besties bro. after all. I was very We're confused. Bro, I was yeah. like, what? You had me with the fit, Ricky. For real? Honestly, yes. Dude, thank you. Dude, this is my girlfriend, C. Ooh, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I thought everybody misheard the question. Dude, I, I took a step and I was like, are these people stupid? Like, why is everyone else stepping up? Like, I, I'm only straight. Y'all are gay. I... That everyone was was gay. Oh. Did the what? Huh? <laughs> what? Have either of you ever been mistaken as gay for more than? Oh, oh yeah. Yes. Oh, yes. 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 For a long time. Uh, I know. Every night, I feel like I'm gonna go out with my friends or whatever. So nobody wanted their money. By more guys than girls sometimes, and. It's um, it's very common, yeah. I got uh, mistaken for being gay a lot of the time. I even, I'll be honest, I went on dates with guys because so many people were suspecting me of it, but I was just like, that's not me. After being yeah. on those dates, I was like, I like women. That's a, that's a fact. My story that I was telling was very genuine. I suppressed my, I guess, my alternative to being macho straight for mm. a long time because I just don't fit the mold for the typical straight guy. There's always questions of, is he or isn't he? Fucking hell, dude. You know what? Whatever you're comfortable with it, with it yourself, you know, it's all good, man. <sighs> I've been training for this shit for a week. How did you train for it? Bro, I faced on all my gay homies. They were saying, like, <laughs> I'm going to be a verse top because that's, like, the least sus, but it's also gay. Do I practice walking? Come on, man. You got to say you're a bottom. If you're going to wear a t-shirt a, a, a like that, you got to say you're a bottom. My fits. 
I was doing like 360 Snapchat videos. Like, dang, do I look gay or not? Like, does my ass pop? I work at Urban Outfitters. There's a lot of gay men. He helped me pick up this nail polish. I called all my gay friends. And I watched like a whole bunch of drag. I watched so much drag, bro. Like, and it's actually I really never, good. I never so watched a drag show. Like, I, had, I had no problem with that. I think my game plan was to just uh, not offend anybody. I hope I... Yeah, Hope I stuck to that. I was because I'm very I'm inclusive. Gonna, I don't think I, 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 I think he was the least offensive, especially right now with the whole red pill movement. Aiden Ross, Andrew Tate, the toxic yeah. male um, yeah. influences out there that it's very important to show, like other men and especially younger men that are coming up into this world that it is okay to be feminine. Is it okay, is it okay yeah. to express your emotions? Is it, yeah. is it okay to be vulnerable? Except everyone. I agree with Matt hundred percent. You know, what I'm saying we live in a, uh, in a society where. You know what I'm saying? Where you have to be mature, where we have to be, you know, toxic masculinity. And, you know, women are bad and things like that. It's like, you know, all the undertake type of dudes. It's like, ugh. It doesn't matter what your looks, sexuality, gender are. Just accept everyone. Yeah. everyone exactly. Exactly. Accept yeah. everyone for no, who they are. You're not as confident as the people who are. Like, not jumping to conclusions and not, like, stereotyping anyone. Uh, letting them speak for themselves. Yeah. I changed my locks into a dude as well, bro. This is my homie Nick. Bruh. He's in the bed. I said, yo, send me a <laughs> selfie with you with your nipple. He said, <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Because I was like, if I turn my phone on, they see yeah, my phone. Yeah, I was like, that. Dude, like that this shocked me, man. This was this was actually was a really good episode. This shocked me, man. Where you got the episode? Let me know coming up below. We'll do a live subscribe to you, boy. You can check out my PP out here. Peace over rock, boy.